Hello again, guys. Um, today is March 5th, and I'm doing a re, uh, an unboxing for Naruto Ultimate Storm 3, which came out today. Let me move this out of the way. This is Budokai HD Collection in my Xbox controller. So yeah, I pre-ordered this about three months ago as soon as I found out the Goku costume was going to be available for DLC if you pre-order it. Mm. And I was really excited for this game. Um, I went out there earlier today with my friend Lawrence. We got five guys right after this for Storm 3 Celebration and whatnot. Um, what can I say? The case, it's amazing. It's it's got all the bijus, uh, not the bijus, but the uh, tail beasts, um, Obito Uchiha, Sasuke Uchiha, Kabuto. Might I point out that 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 Obito has the Rinnegan and the Sharingan and his fourth Great Ninja War outfit, which is amazing. And of course, we have Naruto. And let me put this on focus. Bam. Alright, there we go. It says Goku costume DLC and trading card inside. Of course, that's what happens when you pre-order it. Um, let's look at the back. The fourth great ninja war begins. And there we have Naruto in his Biju mode. The newest one. Um, when he gets stronger. Uh, biggest roster ever. 80 play 80 plus playable characters. Unlock features using cards on Naruto collectible card games using codes. Um, online battles, tournaments, world rankings, and more. It says incredible boss battles. Confront overpowering bosses and re uh, relive key story moments. And on the back we have Naruto, of course, um, Kabuto, Obito Ichiha, um, and a bunch of the ninjas from the Leaf um, and from the Lightning Village, well, hidden in the clouds, which is Raikage. No, not Raikage, but um, Killer B. Sorry about that. I don't think many of my subscribers know that I'm a Nar I'm a huge Naruto fan um, because I don't really upload a lot of Naruto content. It's probably uh, I just don't really feel like it. But with this game, I will definitely be uploading a lot of gameplay, especially with Madara Uchiha, who is unlockable towards the end of the uh, story mode. And of course, that's my DLC um, sheet for. The Naruto Goku costume, I will not be turning it over because that's where the code is at and nobody's going to steal my code. Um, on the disc, it's copied and pasted from the front cover, which isn't, you know, too bad. Um, and here we have Naruto Uzumaki in his Goku costume from the pre-order and whatnot. Um, I don't know exactly what it does with the collectible card games. I mean, I don't really understand that. I haven't played the collectible card games in about seven years, so I wouldn't know what any of this on the bottom means at all. Um, so this is the manual. There's not much inside of it. They don't usually do that nowadays. They don't put a lot inside of the, um, the games. And here we have Naruto in his Biju mode, um, doing a Rasengan. Obito Uchiha. And his fourth grade ninja war outfit, well, mask, and Ghetto Mazo statue, also known as the Ten Tails. So yeah, that's pretty much it for the unboxing. Um, but I'm very, I'm very, very excited for this game, even though I've already played it earlier today on my friend's Xbox on his copy of the game. Um, but when I get into it, I'm gonna, it's probably gonna, I'm gonna be playing it for a while, but not tonight. Um, so tell me what you guys think of this, thought of this unboxing. Um, if you want to see more Storm 3 content, subscribe to my channel, comment, like, peace.